Yes, this is Xander Sportsman, yes, outside Old Trafford. Yep, despite me not being a Man United fan. Yep, I'm at Old Trafford. Yep, I'm Arsenal. Yeah, so great memories here. Celebrating winning the league at this ground. Yep, so I'm here for a stadium tour. Yeah, to um keep my good friend David company standing right here. This is a dream come true for him. <laughs> Yeah. Massive stadium, massive, massive, massive stadium. Yeah, so yeah, I'm gonna see what the stadium tour has to offer. Yep, good afternoon ladies and gents. Yep, this is Xander Sportsman. Yep, at Old Trafford, Manchester, home of Manchester United. Obviously, as most of you know, I'm not a Manchester United fan, but I've come here to keep a company with my friend who is a Manchester United fan. We're going to go inside and we're going to take a tour of the stadium and look around the museum and the club shop. Yeah, day off um, and big, big day for my friend. So I'm just coming to, to uh, support him, not support the football club, but support him. Yeah, uh, bragging rights here as well as we won the league. Uh, Manchester United but listen this is a sports channel I'll, I'll try to be as neutral as possible and not be biased this is for all for all fans across the world of all football clubs try to be fair as possible to all fans and treat um every single fan um, equally as possible and obviously you know I do the boxing um, yeah the, the boxing um, commentary and punditry as well so yeah, um, not just football. So I'm fair to all fans and all supporters and subscribers of my channel. So we're gonna go inside shortly. I'm gonna do the stadium tour. Yep, this is my um friend. Yep, David. Yep, yeah, all right. Yeah, man, big David. Yeah. So um, it should be a big day out for him. I'm not too bothered about the day out, but I'm I'm just coming along. But it should it should be it should be an enjoyable day. Yeah, in, uh, for both parties. But however. I'm just um, coming along, day out in Manchester, I'm not complaining. So, yep, once again, this is Zantube, sorry, this is Zander Sportsman, yep, and um, stay tuned, sorry, yep, stay tuned um, for later videos, yep, um, for today, yep, this is Zander Sportsman, yep, signing out. Okay, yep, so as obviously, I'm not going to talk too much on this tour, as obviously you uh, know, as most people know, this is not my football club, so I'm just going to just walk along and um, just go along with the tour. Uh, I'm, not, I'm not too sure. Well, this is not my football club, so yeah, first time, um, naturally my second time to Old Trafford actually, yeah. Uh, this is Salix Ferguson's uh, sign, so I'm just wandering around and trying to figure out um, which area um, yeah, what part of the stadium is what, basically right, well, yeah, this seems to be the north, no, sorry, the east end, east end yeah Yeah, and East Stand car park. Yep, you got photos of the famous Alex works. And well, let me see this map on here. See what it's saying. Yep. Uh, I think this the um Sir Matt Bosby. I think Sir Matt Bosby statue. A bit further down. I'm gonna go a bit closer. Okay. 
Okay, this is the mega store now. Yeah, they even got a merchandise seller, even on non match day. So that shows you the passion of, yep, Manchester United fans. Manchester United, huh? Well, <laughs> at least us Arsenal fans, that's the only bragging rights to come here. <laughs> Being the only team to win the league here. <laughs> Okay, yep. Yeah. Uh, Law, Cholton. Sorry, no, best Law and Cholton, the Trinity. Mm. Yep. Yeah. You enjoying, right? <laughs> yeah. Oh yeah, the, um, I think that's the match day bridge. Um, I can't remember the name of the bridge, but I think it leads to some kind of canal or something like that. Oh, we'll check it out a bit later. Yeah, massive stadium. Yeah, massive man. The yeah, biggest club stadium in the country. Yeah, man. Well, tour should be coming up soon, so updates yet to come. Okay, yep. This is Zan the Sportsman signing out for now. Okay, so now we're walking towards the club shop. You're past the Sir Matt Bobby statue. Uh, into the club shop right now. I don't know too much about the filming inside here. Uh, so, I'm going to see what he's saying right now. Alright. No, 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 I'm gonna stop it. Yes, so we just booked in for the uh, stadium tour. So, how are you finding it? Yeah, I'm finding it very nice. Yeah, I'm loving it right now. Man. Nice one, nice one. I'm glad you're enjoying your experience despite me not being a Man U fan, but I'm, I'm neutral to all types of sports and new types of sports fans. Yeah, yeah so um, this is the opportunity to voice their opinions and expressions. Yeah. Yeah, fantastic. Yeah, it's massive, man. Club shop is nice as well. Yeah, yeah, fr yeah, yeah for I sure. I enjoy the club shop. Got some stuff here as well. Oh, okay, well done, right. well done. You got some nice piece of merchandise. Yeah, definitely. Yep, definitely. nice one. Yep. So once again, this is Zan the sportsman. Yep, doing a stadium, a museum tour in Old Trafford. Yep. Yes. Yeah, very big stadium, yeah. We've got a lot of history, yep. So, looking forward for this stadium tour now. So, I don't know how they're gonna take forward, but I'm gonna cut it off this minute. Yep. Right. Yeah, 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 certainly. Uh, yeah. Okay, alright. Oh, okay, okay, no problem. Yeah.
Yep, so I think this, yeah, we're heading towards the east end now. Yeah, near the waste section. It's massive in here, man. Right, so we started uh, downstairs in this relic curtain stand. You can now actually see how big that stand is. It can hold approximately it's around under 25,000 seats. So it's actually bigger than four other Premier League clubs. So just to give you a perspective, a bit of perspective, Bournemouth, their stadium, the Vitality, that holds under 12,000 seats. Basically, we could fill their stadium twice with this stand alone <laughs> and still have seats to spare. Yeah, that's how big it is. Take, take a picture. Now we have a closer oh, whoa, 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 look at the pitch no as well. Okay, so now we're going to be heading towards the Old Trafford champion section. That famous <laughs> night in 2002. <laughs> Okay, so now we're entering the Manchester United dressing room. Tactic boards on my right hand side and club logo on the floor. It's a decent size dressing room, not too bad for the home dressing room. energy drinks inside the fridge I can do with one right now mm. Okay, so no. Yeah. <laughs> this is the famous place, Tommy. Yeah. So yeah. So um, I guess this is your team, right? <laughs> oh my God. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Man, all good, man. <laughs> wow. Whoa, I have to disagree about the greatest football club, but they're a very good yeah, club. Yeah. <laughs> well done, everyone. Hope that was quite the experience. You had goosebumps and all. Right, so we are now going to head into the dugouts, so if you want to grab a seat over there, you're more than welcome to do so. 
Oh yes, this is a good experience, <laughs> yep. Uh, despite me not being a red devil, uh, I am enjoying this experience. Yep, so we're heading towards the dugout now. Yeah, what a good walk. Ah, oh, yes. Oh, this, yep, this is the Stretford end. Yep. Okay. Yep, the main stand. And now this is, I think it's the Bobby Charlton stand, if I'm correct. <laughs> well, as I'm not a Red Devil, I have to go and visit him. See him. Section. <laughs> yeah, not a problem, no problem. Yeah, this is the visiting section, just to let you know. Yeah, it's alright, yeah, it's the visiting section. Well, so we have to go by the home section, yeah, I'm man. I'm gonna go by the home and the visiting section. Oh, well, go fair enough. Sections. Okay, so you want hold of one. Alright, okay, okay not a problem. Alright. Everyone, the right side will be meant for Manchester United, the left side is for the opposition team. So we're going to take a look over there because, in my opinion, that's the best. Yep, so all of these are the seats for the director's box. Yep, very steep steps. Yeah, quite a nice seat actually. Yeah, all got names written on it. Uh, oh well. Can't really zoom in too far. Yep. Very nice, comfortable seats, man. Some people are just too lucky. Right, so here will be a decent ticket will cost you around nine hundred fifty pounds. Yes, for for a match ticket, roughly fifty pounds. Oh, okay. Yeah. Yeah, okay, right. But then you have to be still lucky enough to more, find Still way more expensive than the 40. <laughs> <laughs> um, the cheapest ones will be more or less. So 38 pound for a match more you get this seat on the Sir Alex yeah. Ferguson stand, the cheapest inside the whole stadium. <laughs> the final one, yeah. yeah. Final one. <laughs> 38 so pound. So over there, mm. in the fourth All right. row, we have uh, seats for Sir, Alex, uh, Sir Bobby Charlton, sorry. And then next to him, Ole Gunnar Solskjaer has six as well. Of course, he will be joining his players up in the dugouts, but if he wants to invite friends or family, he can over there. The fifth row, it will be for Sir Alex Ferguson. He is the only one that has eight seats over there. Every director has four seats under their names, but no one is brave enough to say no to Sir Alex Ferguson. And well, how could we, because he's been our most successful manager overall anyway. Um, but there's one special seat. The first row, the first seat, is dedicated to our second greatest manager, Sir Matt Bosk. He was the one that took us to European glory back in 1968 in the first English team to win that. 
Okay, so uh, after he retired, he used to take a seat. Unfortunately, he's no longer with us, but that seat is left empty as a sign of respect and memorial to Sir Matt Bosley. Now, if you see directly above us, we have the television gantry. So if you're watching at home, all the main cameras are located upstairs alongside with, uh, with the two match commentators. So if you're wondering how you got there, well, there's a ladder behind of that. Okay, now we're heading towards the VIP lounge. So any Red Devils looking for a season ticket, it is £900. Yeah. Oh, sorry. Cheers. Yep, quite expensive actually, but not as expensive as most grounds in the UK. Mmm, very nice in here actually. It's very nice. Um, yeah, £950, that's right. Actually, yeah, yeah. Very nice. Yeah. So you can see that we treat the press really well. So they oh, yeah, have you all too. the access points for very high-speed Wi-Fi, so that they can refer back to the newspaper or post on social media if they need it as well. They uh, will have a full drinks and something to eat in order to write something nice about the club, but then that doesn't happen often. Um, that S, obviously, it will not be alcoholic drinks. It will only be full of spirits, right? Uh, well, soft drinks or tea or coffee, whatever they want. After there, well, they finish with the press room, they will get access to this room. This room was named uh, after David Mick, which was one of the reporters that passed away uh, in 2018, um, he covered Manchester United for 50 years. He took after um, Tom Jackson, who unfortunately passed away in the uh, Munich Air disaster. He was uh, the reporter for Manchester, uh, Manchester in the News, and then after that, they didn't make it over from him. He was with us for 50 years covering for Manchester United. He was big friends of Sir. Okay, yep, so now we're heading to the press conference room right now. Yeah, it's alright, it's alright, so it's a bit narrow, but it's alright. Yeah, it smells of paint. Not bad. Quite trendy. Oh, yeah. So one day you'll be holding your interviews inside here, yeah. I guess. One day, man. Mm -hmm. All right, they even got USB sockets in that lot. Yeah, yeah man, very trendy. Yeah, first class experience. Yeah. Okay, then, so this is the press room here at Old Trafford. Now, this room is now only used for post match interviews, where the written press will sat where you're sat right now, and they will take, well, the both managers are going to take the questions from the press. Now, as a common courtesy, we'll invite the away team manager to come in first. He's usually has a friend to bring back to travel. So, he wants to finish as soon as possible to get on the road. And he will go. Yep, so this is the end of the stadium tour. 
Yeah, for well, all good things have to come to an end, I guess. Yep, so, yep, I wanna end it here because I'm not really allowed to uh, record inside the club shop. So, that was a very good, enjoyable tour, despite me not being my new friend once again, but I enjoyed it. Okay, yep, this is Zan, the sportsman, signing up. That's right, yep, so we're stepping towards the Old Trafford Museum, taking the lifts up, yep, yeah, what a good experience, oh, yeah. Yeah, very, very nice, and um, for all Red Devils or neutrals or whatever, yep, um, for the whole season, if you pay the £27, last you unlimited for the, for the whole season if you renew your membership, so, yep, ask the staff for more details, so that's very generous of the football club because they understand fans come from all over the globe far and wide yep so save you having to pay again um yep for the year so if you pay the um your membership yep um no sorry if you paid your your one-off fee of 27 pound you can renew it for the rest of the annual year Oh, yeah. Okay, yeah, cheers, cheers. So, heading towards the museum now. Oh, oh, right. yeah. oh I think oh, we've been here before. Yeah, okay. yeah, I'll come for your, for your thing for the year. Oh, yeah, 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 yeah. No problem, no problem. Yeah, I'm not going to say much, but everybody knows Manchester United's history, so yeah, everything says for itself, I'm not going to say anything else. Yeah. Very nice museum. I'm, I'm not going to lie to you. Now you see, you see how successful we are. Yeah, very nice museum. I'm not going to lie at all. They've done a good job in here. Yeah, and uh, Big Daddy, yeah, one day, one day for Arsenal, one day. Oh, very good, very good, very good. Morale is high? Yes, very high. 100,000 expectant fans pack the stands to see great football. 
Bobby Jordan and Gurura exchange Manchester United and Benfica captains. The moment of truth in the battle for mastery of European soccer had arrived. I thought it was already faded. I thought that, you know, that this is for us. Oh, Bobby Jordan and Gurura exchange Manchester United and Benfica captains. Okay, ladies and gents, yeah, good evening once again, yep. Yeah. This is Xander Sportsman, so okay, yep, um, behind me, yep, yep, um, I just finished the stadium tour, and as you can see, the great Sir Alex Ferguson statue, yep, that was um, a very good experience, yep, I enjoyed that, um, the Manchester United um, tour guides had um, very good um, hospitality, I enjoyed that. Uh, it was a very good experience. Yep. Um, yeah, put the rivalry to one side as I'm an Arsenal fan. No big deal. Yep. Um, today, yeah, it was just a good day out in Manchester. Yeah, just to um, see yeah, the, um, yeah, uh, stadium, um, museum, and have a tour guide with my friend who's, um, a loyal Manchester United fan. He's always wanted to come here and this is his first time but he's planning to um, come here for matches in the future as he's impressed in, in what he's seen in Old Trafford. So yeah, it's been a good experience for him and a good day out as well. Yep, I've, I've enjoyed um, everything what I've seen. Yep, Manchester United yep, got a lot of history so I don't need to um, yeah, brag too much. Yeah, so yeah, that's yeah, that's how it is. Yeah, yeah. So yeah, um, that's come to the end of the conclusion now. Yep. Yeah, so yeah, that's all I need to say now. So yep, yeah, this is Zan the Sportsman signing out at Old Trafford, Manchester. Yep. Good night, ladies and gents. Once again, ladies and gents, thanks for watching and hope you subscribe to Zan the Sportsman TV. Yes, the best is yet to come. 2020 is going to be big. More entertaining and exciting sports content yet to come. So stay tuned. Thanks for watching and please subscribe and follow me on social media. Bye.